So most people today wear modern running shoes, right? They've got great big, huge, thick heels full of elastic elements, right? That are very, um, very springy, right? And the reason people wear them is that when you it, it, when you heel strike, it, it 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 spreads that impulse over a longer period of time, so it's comfortable. So it's comfortable to heel strike in a modern running shoe. But the problem with the modern running shoe is that it forces you to heel strike, you know. And, and until basically the mid 1970s. We think that nobody heel struck very often because it involves this big, huge collisional force. And so the, the shoe is comfortable when you heel strike, but you're still having a collision. The, the, the heel slows that rate of loading uh, from the collision about sevenfold. So, so it's much, much, much more comfortable than if you were heel strike barefoot, but it's still there. And there's still a, a magnitude of that collision, and there's still a rate of that collision that is high enough that over you know, thousands and millions of times of landing, it could cause injury. Now, we don't know this for, sh for sure, because nobody's done the studies, but, um, but if you think about it, if you run 20 miles a week, that means that you're hitting the ground about a million times a year, right? And every single one of those collisions has a rapid rate of loading, right? And a high magnitude of loading, and over time, that can build up damage.